So you're thinking about moving to Orange Beach, Alabama and the surrounding areas? Well, today I am gonna walk you through one of my favorite dine-in restaurants. A cute atmosphere, great food. It's on the water and it's centrally located to everything being at the wharf. I'm gonna show you the canal. I'm gonna show you the outside seating, the bar area. Um, as I mentioned, such amazing food, really affordable prices, um, comparatively speaking to what prices have jumped up to. This is still a really great place to eat um, on your pocketbook and the food is excellent. So I can't wait to show it to you. Also next door is the Spring Hill Suites, which is a really nice hotel. If you're thinking about coming into town and you don't know where to stay and you want to check out the area or look at real estate, um, Spring Hill Suites, you can get into there and then you can just walk right over to Mile Marker 158 and then you can also walk to the wharf which has a ton more of dining and entertainment there. So really a great location and I can't wait to show it to you. Hey guys, if this is your first time to the channel, please like, subscribe, and ring the little bell. That way you can be notified each and every time we put out new content regarding the current market conditions of Orange Beach, Gulf Shores, and the surrounding areas. My name is Aileen Fountain, along with my partner, Andy Hollis. We do these videos each and every week just to be informative and let you know what it's like to live at the beach. So whether it's nine days or 90 days from when you're thinking about making your move, Call us, text us, email us, set up a Zoom with us. We'd love to meet with you face-to-face. -face. We get calls and texts and emails from people just like you every single day, and we absolutely love it. So just as I was saying, I'm going to walk you through this restaurant, Mile Marker 158. would love for you to come check this place out. Uh, it's, it's never busy, but there's always people here. And what I love about it is that it checks every box, right? Like you want a restaurant that's in a good location. You don't want to have to drive far to it. You want a restaurant that has a great atmosphere. And of course, what you came there for, you want a restaurant that has great food. Well, this is one that checks all those boxes. And I have to tell you, I am um, pretty hard on restaurants and I do like to rank things. And every time I've come here, the meal has been fantastic. The atmosphere has been great. The service has been great. And um, as you're about to see, the view is pretty good too. So let's go check a look. All right, here we are. Very cute atmosphere. Here's our server, Chelsea. She was fantastic. Hey, Chelsea. I have also had some social gatherings at this bar. It's a little windy today, but also have an outdoor bar, outdoor seating. Tons of waterfront seating. Mile marker 158, dockside, bar and grill. Here's the marina at the wharf. You can tell they're adding some boat slips over there and off to the distance you can see the wharf condos and that is your um, bridge from the Foley Beach Express that comes into Orange Beach. And you can almost see, you can kind of see the Ferris wheel at the wharf off to a distance. This right here, right next door is the Spring Hill Suites I was mentioning. Right next door. And there, from there, you could um, walk underneath the bridge to the wharf. really pretty and warm out today but it is windy look at the wind going Hi, Tasha. Hi. Do you have um, anything you can share with the viewers about why this restaurant is so wonderful? I've just mentioned how good the food is. Okay. 
Um, it's also related to all the restaurants in the wharf, so Bellagio, Gin and Lane, Yoho Bum Bar and Taco. This is our newest addition to the restaurant group. Um, we're still fairly new and we're trying to build a clientele. We have great view, great food. The staff is very friendly and accommodating. Um, come out and see us. We will start opening on Sundays also, so we'll be glad to have y'all. And one, uh, one other question, Tasha. What, um, what are the most favorite things that people have been ordering and enjoying? We have a fantastic beef bites. Um, it's a nice starter um, option on menu. Um, it's served with some gorgonzola cream sauce. It's so delicious. Um, for dinner, I suggest the sachetti pasta. Um, it's usually paired with beef bites, but you can get it with some shrimp if you like. We'll, we accommodate everything. Um, allergies, your pets can come. <laughs> <laughs> so we just want everyone to come and enjoy themselves. Well, thank you so much, yeah. Tasha. Have a good day. So some of the menu items that I have had that have been particularly amazing, I love the tater tots on the appetizer menu. Uh, our server told us that the beef tips, um, beef bites that are on the appetizer menu are fantastic, but we ended up getting the beef tortellini, which was an entree, and it was delicious. Also got the blackened chicken with gouda mashed potatoes and asparagus. Uh, which was also fantastic. In the past, I've had a uh, grilled shrimp salad here. I've had their salmon here. Both were amazing. I always get the tater tots though because they never disappoint. They have blue cheese and bacon crumbles and like a cheesy sauce uh, topped with shredded lettuce and that's just absolutely wonderful. So I have not had anything that was not fantastic here. I'm told their burgers are good. Um, there's pretty much I wanted to order everything on the menu today. So um, anyway, you should definitely come check this out. Come stay at the wharf if you want to check out the city of Orange Beach and the surrounding area. This is a great location because you can hop right on the expressway and get to pretty much anywhere you want to go or you're just a couple miles to the beach. So anyway, this is about going to wrap everything up for this video. And uh, if you're new to the channel, Go ahead and like, subscribe, and ring the little bell. That way you can be the first ones notified of upcoming uh, current market conditions and upcoming videos so you can get a feel for what it's like to live at the beach. You know the beach life. So until then, we'll see you around town.